Mr Kinkorla, um, I'd like to direct my question to the Minister for Health, please. Minister, can I raise with you again the, in relation to the numbers waiting for fair deal? Um, I know there has some work has been done, but the, the numbers fluctuated wildly in September. On the 17th of September, there was 525 waiting, but by the 30th, the number had increased again to 686, which is an increase of 30 per cent. And, Minister, we also know that there are 745 people currently waiting to be discharged from hospital. It's a vicious cycle. If we could access people quickly, quicker to fair deal, as we know, we would free up more capacity in the hospital. So could I just ask you, have you an approach to this to try and deal with it, please? I want to thank Deputy Butler for her important question. Uh, we have provided enough funding to keep the fair deal wait at four weeks from now to the end of the year. We are beginning to see the delayed discharges, admittedly from a high base, uh, now beginning to fall. As I said to Deputy Buckley, the HSE now has an additional £26 million for winter planning between now and the end of the year. That should mean more home care, more transitional care and more fair deal places. But I will get the Deputy a specific note on fair deal numbers.